Oh, it's Nathan. Uh, me. It's me. Hello, it's me, Nathan. Today is September 23rd. And it is a Wednesday. Maybe. And I'm driving from San Francisco down to Los Angeles via California 1, aka the Pacific Coast Highway, I think, but I'm not sure. I came back from Alaska and Hawaii over the weekend, and a bit of last week. It was nice. It was cold in Alaska and hot in Hawaii. I only packed for the I only packed for the summer months, but I did bring a hoodie and a jacket and cotton socks. Basically, I was underprepared. I tried to power through my days in Alaska because I knew Hawaii would be pretty good. Anyway, um, I don't know if I saw Martin Luther King Jr. drive Boulevard or Street in Hawaii in Honolulu, but there were a lot of Hawaiian street names where the ratio of vowels to consonants are pretty much one to one. Sometimes you'll get states that are named Iowa and Ohio and Idaho and they all sound very similar and obviously the the vowel to consonant ratio is so skewed towards the vowels, which isn't traditional, I don't think. And sometimes I do mix them up on accident. I feel like an idiot. But you know, sometimes you look at a word and you look at it long enough that you'll start to wonder if it's spelled right. Even the word goes, G-O-E-S, goes. If you look at that word long enough, you're like, I don't know if this word is right. And you get the really, really weird looking words like unbeknownst. I drove by a city or a street named Lynch. It's just all really weird. And for the most part, I think I'm pretty good at spelling. But when it comes to native words. Not so much. It's, it's the equivalent of whenever you're in a room at night and you're getting ready to fall asleep and the only sound you can hear is your clock as it ticks every second. And the more you think about it, the longer that second hand sounds. You know, it's impossible. But it just, it's louder. And this is the same thing, but with words in your eyeballs. It's impossible that the word goes is misspelled and that you can talk. There's no way you can ever misspell that word. It's a four letter word. But, 
stare at it long enough, you're gonna start thinking you're an idiot like me. Also, that Biggie song where he's rapping about returning to California. I came on the iPod when it was in shuffle mode earlier. So that seemed kind of appropriate.